Kev, when you just talk about some of the guys that I have my eye on. Oh, beautiful play. Ronaldo Cisneros. In on goal, Cisneros! Two minutes in! And that's how you start off the game at home. Ronaldo Cisneros. He's a poacher. You talked about him being a guy who feeds off with good opportunities. Well, the last few games, he hasn't gotten too many looks in these kind of positions. But the goal is really, really well worked. Good combination play between the likes of Araujo in the midfield and, and Cisneros. He picks his time perfectly. Gets the ball out of his feet. Maybe could have done better with a second touch, but he makes no mistake with... Aggressive step from Ibala in midfield. Osetu. Moreno. Against Sekulic. Osetu! Still there! Goal! Ronaldo Cisneros has a break! Because you have players who get in the box for rebound. And it all starts with this duel being won here by Ibarra. Chicago does a good job of setting up defensively. And they're looking to spring in the attack in transition. But Ibarra wins that initial ball. Good play through. Get to the end line there. Rosetti with the shot, that Tesla Nina, strong save by the keeper, strong left hand, but who is there? The poacher we talked about, Ronaldo Cisneros, getting the double, regaining the lead for his Atlanta United faithful, and that's what you want to see from this attack. Patrick's in Major League Soccer, and Schuttenworth finds Ibarra, but the last of which came in July of 2018. That's the last hat-trick scored by an Atlanta United player. And we say it as Ronaldo Cisneros goes in on goal. Can he score? The hat-trick, he has it! Right on cue! Okay, but I love when you speak things into existence. <laughs> I need you to do that a little bit more, all right? And this starts all the way from shuttled words. Good entry ball, Amada picks it up and has acres of space to attack. But it's the running off the ball of Cisneros. Just seeing a little bit of a gap. And the two center backs had actually set, stepped up a little bit higher. But it's Sekulic who keeps him offside. Keeps his composure. Bates Lanina to come out. And in the first half, within 35 minutes, Ronaldo Cisneros has a hat trick here in Atlanta. One, two, three. Welcome to Atlanta, Ronaldo Cisneros. I'll say it again. First hat trick for Cisneros in his career. First hat trick for Atlanta. Slonina picks out Emerson Hyman. Beautiful turn from Hyman. Luis Araujo. Back it goes for Emerson Hyman. Low delivery for Cisneros. Falls Kylie. They finally established a good sequence of play here. Movement off the ball, the run in behind from Hyman to get into a dangerous area. But where he puts the ball, he puts it back into a dangerous area. That little cutback. Araujo recognizes his run, the little cutback, and you see Brooks running in your screen now. He's just following the play, staying alert, staying lively, knowing that there might be potential for danger. When Chicago wins the first ball, there's no one there to put pressure on the second one, and it's Brooks Lennon who has the composure on his left, his weaker left foot, to pick out the back post, top bends. Come on now, 90th what minute is it? What is it about this man, huh? Stoppage time. Team is Araujo looks to break through. And there it is, confirmation of three points. A return to winning ways for Gonzalo Pinedas, Atlanta United. Brooks Lennon with the nightcap. Ronaldo Cisneros, not one, two, but three goals for the Mexican leading the line for Atlanta United. A night he'll never forget. And that winning feeling, imperative mode, knowing that including tonight, you're on a run of four matches from five at Mercedes. They controlled this game. They controlled this, this game with the ball. They controlled this game and how they scored their goals, how they created the goals. And this is the performance that they can use to now build on.